Chlorine has been used uh, for a very long time, since the 1920s, to sanitize uh, city suburb water. And it works very, very well in terms of killing the bugs in the water and uh, cleaning up the water. Um, but studies now show that when chlorine has the ability to react with organic matter like decayed leaves, that uh, chlorine can create uh, disinfection byproducts, which are called trihalomethanes. And studies show that these uh, disinfection byproducts have been linked to certain types of cancer. Uh, in addition, uh, chlorine can also be very, very drying to your skin and to your hair. So uh, although we do feel it's uh, very important to have the water chlorinated at the, uh, the city water plant and through the distribution into your home, ideally once the water enters your home, uh, we like to take it out. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to uh, call on George to uh, pour water into two uh, glasses. And this is just ordinary sink water that came from the city. And what I'm going to do is actually show you how readily absorbed chlorine is into your skin. And in order to do that, I have a chlorine test kit here. And I'm going to actually add 20 drops to each glass of water. And before I do, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my hand as far as I can get it into the glass here for about 45 seconds to a minute. Now the reason why I have my hand in this glass of water is depending upon how much chlorine is in this water, if it is readily absorbed into the skin, when I do this demonstration and I add the drops, this water should remain clear. Now the other glass of water that my hand is obviously not in that's just ordinary sink water, once again from the city, should turn a bright yellow color, representing that there is chlorine in the water. So what I'm going to do now okay, is I'm going to add 20 drops to each flask, or to each glass. And I'm going to start with just the, uh, the city water. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And then I'm going to add the drops to the city water with my hand in it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So as you can see, the glass of water that I had my hand in, my fingers in, is completely clear where the other glass of water is loaded with chlorine. So obviously what happened here was the chlorine was readily absorbed into my skin. And just imagine taking a uh, 10 to 15 minute shower, what would happen then?